Hey folks, this is Mr. Curtis, and today we're going to be taking a look at line 79. So uh, this line, number one, there's going to be a test over on Friday, so I'm, we're doing an early introduction, give you time to practice it throughout the week. Um, it uses an amalgamation of all the different variations of 16th note rhythms. So like if you look at example number one, it does have eighth notes. If you look at example number two, it has 16th notes. Number three, it has the eighth followed by 16th. And then number four, it has the 16th followed by the eighth. They're all in here. So we need to make sure that we can clap and count those. So let's take a look at measure one. Let's clap and count measure one together. Here we go. Ready and go. Now, one T take dot, two T take dot. Try that again. Ready and go now. One T take dot, two T take dot. Okay, let's take a look at measure three. Straight 16th notes. Ready and go now. One T take ta, two T take ta. Same thing. Go now. One T take ta, two T take ta. Good. Let's take a look at measure five. This is the first measure of the second line. It sixteenth notes are first. So you clap on one T and T. Ready and go now. One T take ta, two T take ta. Try again. Ready and go now. One T take ta, two T take ta. You're gonna be tempted to want to like say things on every syllable like one T take ta, but you gotta be really careful to make sure you're going one T take ta, one T take ta. Don't clap on ta for those uh, rhythms there at measure five. Um, otherwise, just be observant of the staccato markings, right? Stop the bow in between notes when you have a staccato marking like in measure one or in measure five or in the last two measures, so just watch out for those. The notes themselves are fairly simple for most of us. This is entirely on the D string. The basses, you guys will transition to the G string for one note. Um, otherwise, pizzicato it, clap and count it a lot, and shadow bow it a lot, all right? So here we go, I'm gonna set my measure to 50. Watch out for staccatos, shadow bow and arco. Go back to this part of the video as many times as you need. I have my second finger set for my F sharp. Balance point, one, two, Ready and go now. Off reset. Hopefully you notice how I was stopping my bow uh, in between notes when I had a staccato marking the old dot. It's below the note. So be aware of that, pause the bow, go back and play along with that part of the video as many times as you need to to be successful. You have a test on this on Friday. And if you are looking at this on Friday as a review, good luck. 